Hi, so I've got a big bag packed. Um, so we're going somewhere today. Our neighbors are being a little bit loud. We are going to Hainan Island. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it correctly, but this island and this city. And we're gonna have a photo shoot on the beach. I literally found out that I'm about to fly to another province like a few hours ago. Luckily, I didn't have any plans as I always don't have any plans because today is Monday and I'm supposed to like be available if any jobs or castings happen today. Now I just triple checked, no, quadruple checked whether or not I have my passport. I can tell you with certainty now that I do have it, but I'm always just really paranoid that I will forget it. My flight is in literally five minutes. Why are we not boarding? I suspect this will take a while. Oh boy. Would you like to hear a little story, like a little update? So right now it is midnight, exactly midnight. My plane was supposed to take off at 8.30, but now I just got information that the plane will take off at 1.30. So it has been delayed quite a bit, but I will tell you the most interesting thing about this situation is that tomorrow my call time of the job, like we start makeup at 5 a.m., right? 5 a.m. And I will be in Hainan Island at 2.30. So this is like the best scenario because it could be late also. The way from the airport to my hotel is one hour. I just checked, it's one hour. I will be in the hotel at 4 a.m., right? And my job starts at 5 a.m. <laughs> and before my job, I need to wash my hair, obviously have a shower. Like there's just no time for sleep. And my booker for my agency, she's kind of tried to negotiate with this client that maybe they could start a little bit later. And she's so sweet, like, I literally have the best agency. Anyway, so, but they cannot start later because later in the day there should be like a thunderstorm. Surprise, surprise, there were no thunderstorms. I'll keep you updated, okay? Ha ha ha. If I wasn't laughing now, I would be crying. So friends, getting a taxi at 3 a.m. was much harder than I thought. But after waiting for 30 minutes I managed to get one, however in the middle of our trip the driver had to charge the car and I started worrying if I will even make it to the hotel before 5 a.m. I just came to my hotel, it is 4.50, so I started my job in 10 minutes. <laughs> so now I'll just go wash my hair and then just go straight to the makeup artist with my wet hair because that's what she told me to do Okay, it's 12 right now and we have already finished. I literally have the entire day and then I have work tomorrow. I don't know what to do, but I'm also kind of exhausted. Yeah, so I'll just go to swim. I'm ready. I'm so happy right now. I don't even want to sleep anymore. The water was just perfect. But a few days ago, I got into a little bicycle accident, sort of. And I've got some bruises on my knees. And it was pretty painful with the salty water. I literally fell off a bike. Now I feel like I will just go to the shower because I just swam in the sea. 
Okay. Now after the shower, I do feel kind of tired. I just slept for like three hours. But they gave me this huge coconut, basically. And I'm about to drink it, drink the water. I love coconut water so much. I finished super early again it's 10 30 so I don't know but I have no idea when my flight back to Guangzhou is so yeah I'm just now if I have enough time I might go for a swim but I'm not sure mm -hmm. 